we on our way home from work. You know, we're just chilling. You know, we'll make y'all a little POV video, you know, with a little bit of pools here and there. Can't do too much craziness, but, you know, if y'all new to the channel, make sure y'all subscribe, like this video. Texas so y'all let me know what y'all want to see about to get on this highway pretty sure it's going to be a lot of traffic so I ain't finna hop on this shit cause I already see it so I'm going to roll the windows down a little bit but yeah the car is on Full drag pack. Uh, it's on uh, 93 tune right now because the car been sitting for like two weeks. So I just went ahead and switched it over since we didn't have any AC. I was like, you know what? I ain't for to keep trying to go run to get E85, and the car ain't even up and running. So until we run this 93 out, I switch back over to the E85 tune and go from there but uh y'all been watching the videos stay tuned we're gonna have some more videos for y'all trying to hit the track soon but uh my anniversary is coming up on the 6th of september so y'all guys somehow because i know y'all want to see the car out there performing you know everybody talks about what their cars do but they don't really be showing that motherfucker race yeah you did all this shit but how does the shit work how does it perform you know we can sit here and talk all day about our cars how fast they are, but if you ain't running nothing that's faster than you or even attempted to run anybody, then how you gonna tell somebody what part is good or something is good for their car if you're just showcasing your car? Well, yeah, so that's that. Like, I ain't got a lot, of, a lot to say. You know, I encourage all my YouTubers to stay strong, keep it going. And, you know, trust the process. You know, nothing in life is easy. You know, to be good at something, you have to continue to work, 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 and master your craft. You know, I'm not good at making content and 
making these videos for y'all, but I'm doing the best I goddamn can. So, that's all I can say. But, y'all leave a comment, let me know what y'all wanna see as far as future videos, you know. I do want a twin turbo to this car, so should I go twin turbos? Should I go with the ESS? Should I go with the Whipple? You know, I am a stick car. I plan on staying with the stick. So, not because I just, y'all will say, trying to be slow, but it just, I have more fun with this than driving the automatic. Because I can drive anybody's 10 speed and probably run the same exact, same exact times that y'all running on the track or probably even better. This is a, a motherfucking challenge because this is not always like that. So you gotta work with this, it's just a lot of factors. And a lot of people don't wanna have to deal with a lot of factors. They want it as easy as comes. That's why a lot of people just choose to Oh yeah, I want a thousand horsepower. Take it to the shop. Now you got a thousand horsepower. What you do with that thousand horsepower, you know, hey, that's on you. But hey, but as you can see, this is what our highways look like. Stop and go. So and a lot of uh, open road right now. Like 101, feel like 105 in this bit. But yeah, I gotta get the truck fixed. I think I got bad cats on the on the Ford that I picked up. So we'll find out once I either drill some holes in them or just unbolt it from the manifold. So you know, stay tuned to that. I already had changed the spark plugs on it. Not a spark plug issue, so it's more probably like it got a clogged cat or something because it's bogging down when you put it in drive. So, yep. Man, glad to be off. shifter 
motor mounts and still on a stock K member. So, so good old nice Trans Am right there. Trans Am. Oh. 